Buying an EV, it's exciting. But before your car arrives, you need to make sure your home can actually charge it. Mahindra offers two home charger options, a 7.2 kilowatt and an 11.2 kilowatt. Let me break down what you need to set them up in the simplest way possible. The first step is a parking space. You'll need a fixed parking spot where the charger can be installed. In societies or apartments, this means getting permission from the RWA, which is the Residence Welfare Association. Without a dedicated space, installation is tricky. Step 2 is the power connection type. The 7.2 kW charger works on a single phase connection, which most homes already have. The 11.2 kW charger, which is faster, usually needs a three phase connection. So check your meter or your electricity bill or ask your electrician. Step 3 is the sanctioned load. This is the most important part and this is where most people go wrong. The sanctioned load isn't just for the charger, it's for your whole house. If your charger pulls the entire sanctioned load, your other appliances won't work. For the 7.2 kW charger, aim for at least 9 to 10 kW of sanctioned load. And for the 11.21, go for 15 watts or higher with a three phase supply. If your current sanction load is less, don't panic. You can easily apply for an upgrade through your electricity board. Mahindra's installer or your dealer will be able to guide you. Step four is installation and safety. Mahindra will send an authorized installer to handle wiring, earthing, and safety devices. All you need to do is ensure that there's a safe covered spot for the charger and that your building has proper earthing. Step 5 is knowing about the cost and charging time. The 7.2 kW charger costs around 50,000 while the 11.2 is about 75,000 rupees plus installation charges. The charging times for the 59 kW battery are about 9 hours on the smaller charger and 6 hours with the 11.2. For the 79 kilowatt hour battery, it's about 12 hours versus 8 hours. Both are fine for overnight charging, but you can choose based upon the frequency of your trips. So, here's your checklist before the car arrives. A dedicated parking spot, single phase or three phase supply depending on the charger, and a sanctioned load of 9 to 10 kilowatt for 7.2 kilowatt chargers and 15 plus kilowatt for the 11.2. Once these are sorted, Mahindra's installers will take care of the rest and you'll be set for hassle-free home charging. If this video cleared your doubts, hit like, comment your questions below and subscribe for more honest TV updates. I'll see you in the next one.